very good morning to all of you as always i am happy and excited to be back amongst you all for another new session of virtual learning today i am going to show you certain new things but prior to that let us first sing together a new english alphabet song you kids ready shall we start a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y and z now you know your a b c s next time won't you sing with me so let's do the song one more time a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y and z now you know your a b c s next time won't you sing with me as you all know in our previous classes i had taught you how to write the letters i l t a m v w e f h and n with the help of standing lines slipping lines right slanting lines and left slanting lines i'm sure you all had been practicing the above mentioned letters time and again back at your homes remember one thing the more you will practice the better you will become i can sense you all must be curious and wondering which are those new letters that i am going to teach you as to how to write with the usage of standing lines slipping lines right slanting lines and left slanting lines so let me reveal those new letters then okay today i am going to show you how to write the letters k x y and z using various combinations of standing lines slipping lines right slanting lines and left slanting lines for each of these four letters so let us begin with the letter k kids in order to write this letter k we will require to first draw a standing line next a right slanting line and follow it up with a left slanting line standing line right slanting line left slanting line shall we try one more time standing line right slanting line left slanting line like this let us proceed to the next letter that is x well in the case of x we have to draw a right slanting line and a left slanting line that move across each other right slanting line left slanting line like this let us try this one more time right slanting line left slanting line good exactly like this the third letter which you all are going to learn today is y in order to write the letter y we will first draw a left slanting line followed by another right slanting line and finally draw a standing line to complete this letter y left slanting line right slanting line standing line let us try this one more time left slanting line right slanting line standing line like this right yes finally the last letter which we are going to learn today is 
Z. So the letter Z requires a pair of slipping lines and one right slanting line. Let me show you which line comes after the other. First we need to draw a slipping line. Then follow it up with a right slanting line. And finally another slipping line like this. Let us try one more time. Slipping line, right slanting line, another slipping line. Well, that's all for today. I want you all to practice this properly.